Reactive motions by humans when they are hit, pushed, or pulled are very important to make computer animation lively. In this paper, we propose a new method to interactively generate reactive motions for arbitrary external perturbations. The feature of our method is that it can be applied to motions with arbitrary contact states such as standing, walking, or running. The method proposed in this paper works under the following scenario. First, a number of reactive motions of humans are captured by pushing and pulling a person to various directions under a safe environment. The subject is pushed from eight different directions while standing and walking. The user will then import some captured motion data to be used as a primary motion. Then, at an arbitrary moment, an external perturbation is applied to the body which is modeled as an effective increase in the linear momentum and angular momentum around the center of mass. Using the impact of the external perturbation and the posture as a key, a counteracting reactive motion will be searched in the database to be blended into the primary motion. Since we use the computationally efficient criteria, the reactive motion can be searched in real time. The trajectories of the feet and momentum of the primary motion will be blended into those of the reactive motion. Using the blended trajectories as constraints, the generalized coordinates of the body are calculated using momentum-based inverse kinematics. Due to the nature of capturing of the reactive motion, it is difficult to cover all directions and magnitude of impact forces. Therefore, it is necessary to edit the existing reactive motions by changing the impact applied to the body. In order to handle different impacts, we propose a new method to edit the trajectories of the feet and the linear and angular momentum according to the amount of impact. This method is based on the observation of the human reactive motions. The position of the foot steps are also adjusted according to the impact. Because motions are generated using inverse kinematics, it is also possible to add additional constraints such as fixing the position of the hands or specifying the velocity of some segments of the body. Here we show an example of hitting the head while constraining the arms at the back. Because the arms are fixed, the whole chest is bent backward to generate angular momentum that was originally generated by the arms. The reactive motion that will be chosen will change according to the direction and amplitude of the impact. Here we show a demo hitting a character from different directions under the same condition. Here is an example of repeatedly applying external perturbations to the body. According to the current status of the body and the condition of the impact, the most appropriate motion in the database will be selected, edited, and merged into the current motion.